Good morning, everybody. Daryl here, man with sense. Coming to you from home today. <laughs> uh, today, we're kind of doing a little bit of a challenge here. We've got um, a new one that I picked up at um, TJ Maxx, one of those that um, people say they've been seeing there. It's a Latafa fragrance. It's Latafa Ram Silver. And, and I also... I picked up the, uh, not in today's video, but the top of Rams Gold. Very nice fragrance also. I've been wearing them for the last few days, on and off, in between others. <laughs> and at the same time with others. Like, but anyway, um, today we're gonna go with, uh, we're gonna kinda test all of them, see which one that's the best, cause uh, Ultra Mall is one of, one of my favorites. I don't know about any of y'all. But I'm sure there's others out there that have it as a favorite also. And uh, the bottle's not so bad, too bad. It's got, you know, all that writing on it, like people say. Makes me think of the 80s for some reason, with the cool and hot and love. But anyway, nice bottle overall. Cap's got a little weight to it, but mostly plastic. Uh, Latafa on it here and there. <laughs> but and I do like the little inset plates. They could have left all the writing off for my part and just went with the little metal plates. Um, but we're gonna we're gonna wear this one today. Nothing on but lotion yet. We're gonna put that one there. One, and then we've got Atar Al Wasal, which is from Al Watania, which is my current favorite version of this. I'm sure if y'all watched my channel before, this is one of my absolute favorites. Love the bottle on this one, and the. Uh, quality <laughs> we're going to see how matchable it is we got that one there on that hand hmm. and then we've got Afnon's 9pm which is uh, one of the hot beasts that's been out there uh, and I'm not going to knock it it's a good fragrance but nearest I can tell so far I like both of these better um, we'll put it up here on the arm that fan blew that one away yeah, see I just, I just don't like that one as well it comes way across way more tart on the top with that apple than that instead of the pear Guys, honestly, the Atar Al was saw and the uh, these two uh, smell almost the same. This one, like I say, has that little bit of tartness at it, you know, where they uh, swapped out the apple and the pear. But anyway, guys, on the, uh, let me get over here on the trusty iPad. The, uh, let's see, Atar, Atar Al was saw. We'll go down here and look at the notes. Pear, lavender, mint, bergamot, lemon. Mid notes are cinnamon, clary, sage, and cumin. Base is uh, black vanilla husk, amber, cedar, and patchouli. Okay, we move to the Latafa Rim Silver. One of the things I do not like about that 9 p.m. bottle, it tips over so easy. This one, um, the Rim Silver notes are this is all according to Fragrantica, y'all. Uh, pear, lavender, bergamot, mint, cardamom, sage, vanilla, amber, musk, patchouli. Pretty much the same thing. Okay, and then we've got the uh, 9 p.m. Figure out which one we are here. Oop, pushed the wrong one, guys. that or I lost it one or the other and that's debatable if you ask some people and the 9 p.m. is apple cinnamon wild lavender and bergamot on the top orange blossom lily of the valley vanilla tonka bean amber and patchouli 
which uh, you get those differences with this one. It's, it's just, not, it doesn't appeal to me. I can already tell you now, this one's a loser in my opinion, <laughs> but it's still a good fragrance, guys. Just smelling the uh, rams. Well, these two smell almost the same. Be honest, I can't tell much different. But this one is this one is totally different. Uh, the 9 p.m. comes across, like I say, a lot more tart with more uh, uh, citruses to it, I think. Uh, and the dry down on it is not as sweet. sweet as these two um, but I will let you know more I know this one and this one have about the same longevity which is pretty much forever it lasts a good long while I get I get probably eight hours or more out of both of these guys this one uh, I'm getting real close to that too it's getting anywhere from seven to eight hours but it's new and it may get stronger as it goes but the uh, Notes, as you see, are quite a bit different, or as you hear, I should say, are quite a bit different. Uh, I'll let you know the difference on these as far as um, longevity goes. I can tell you now, this one right here is probably going to last the longest, which is the Atar I was off. It pushes. It pushes way better than, than any of these, but... So therefore, <laughs> we're going to put that one up here. Anyway, guys, today's sin of the day is a, a copy of uh, JPJ's Ultramall. Kind of a conglomeration scent. I smell good all the way around, though. Um, if you see any of these guys, like I say, look for these here. If you've got TJ Maxx or if it's available to you or Ross or, or uh, Burlington area, those oops. From what I hear, these are showing up at the... Uh, rack stores. I also seen um, Latafa's Fakara there, but I didn't need it. I already had it. It's up there somewhere. Um, but guys, if you see these, this one is excellent. Uh, the price on them, probably this one's going to be your best price. The uh, Ram Silver. Uh, I hadn't looked at the one, the price on 9 p.m. lately, but I'll put some links in the uh, description for all three, uh, if I can find them, of course. Uh, I got my this one I got from uh, oh uh, Essence of Love in Florida, like TJ Maxx, and I got this one. Uh, I think I want to think I got it at uh, LaBelle, maybe. But I'm not sure on this. It's been a long time. This was the very first one I bought uh, of these three, which was, boy, it was right after this one came out and was hyped up quite a bit last year, I guess. But check these out, guys. If you see them, Atar Al Wasal, Latafa's Rim Silver, and Afnon's 9 p.m. All great copies of JPG. Just this one here, the Al Wasal, is my favorite. Check them out if you see them, guys. <clears throat> Later, y'all.